what if it's terrible and I hate it? I'll cry. Welcome to Cat and Raven Designs. I'm Cat, they them. And I'm Raven, she, her. It is the final design. The collection comes out this Friday. So let's get this last one done. You mean tomorrow? Yeah, tomorrow. Here is the logo for our Under the Sea collection, which is again coming out tomorrow. Bringing you four designs. This is the last one, Jellyfish. And it is going to be available at 8 a.m. on the 26th. So we will see you then for sure for that. In the meantime, we're jumping right into it. This is my design. It is inspired by Jellyfish. I am really hoping I can sort of evoke the Jellyfish feel with this. So fingers crossed. I'm going to be doing this in four layers on a tilted mold. And I, it's going to take a while. But hopefully it comes out well. Time for fragrance and colorants. And my fragrance, which hopefully does not get us demonetized in the first like 30 seconds of the video, is Sex on the Beach. It's a drink, YouTube. Calm down. Okay? Okay. Here are your fragrance notes on the screen. And away it goes. My personal notes on here include that it has a 5% usage rate and it separates. I'm assuming that's what the S means. It's gotta be. It's not D or A. D for discoloration. A for acceleration. Oh. Separation's gotta be what it is. Oh, D's not like D? No. Why would I? No. <laughs> and A is not like T and A? No! <laughs> I'm, I'm going to go into safety mode. Here we go. Boom. Safety mode enhanced and applied, I guess. My base that's going to be going across all four layers is a mixture of dark navy blue and climb blue. It's about a 50-50. Next up is pink neon, green neon, and I used up the last of the blue neon on my Dark Mermaid soap. So this is ultramarine blue with just a couple drops of titanium because I'm worried it's going to be too dark and too similar to the base color. Then we have purple neon, and then I'm going to be rounding out the top with these Melt and Pour jellies, which I have brushed with glittery micas to make the uh, very, very, very skinny mold stand out a little bit more so you can see it. I'm going to admit a certain degree of concerns here. So I really, really love jellyfish. I grew up going to the Monterey Bay Aquarium with my family and going into the jelly room and just jellies like nature's lava lamps. And I just love looking at them. When I get my next tattoo, it might very well be a jellyfish because uh, watercolor jellyfish tattoos are really pretty. And I'm a dork. But I am concerned whether or not my idea here for making this work is going to work <laughs> and it's involving a lot a lot of stuff on the table right now and a lot of moving parts so there's a good chance that I'm going to just focus and I'm sorry if that happens I'll talk as much as I can but pretty good chance there's going to be a certain degree of fast forwarding so wish me luck so I'm starting off with a fourth of our batter separated out it already has kale and clay and the fragrance oil mixed in and I just need to add our lye A really light blend here. I'm worried about those separation notes. I also, for my own notes, lowered the usage rate as well. It could use up to 5.7 ounces of fragrance oil and I lowered it to four. I don't want to deal with separation. So the plan to try and achieve the look here in the design is I'm gonna do one big thick pour of the pink, and then I'm gonna pour the rest of the pink into the base so that we have kind of a swirly. Fingers crossed. <laughs> I don't know how well this is gonna work. This is meant to be sort of like the head of the jellyfish. Hopefully this gives us jellyfish vibes. Ooh. <laughs> Nerves! <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm really scared, cat. It's gonna f it up. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna try holding this with my hand because I feel better about that. Ah, no! <gasps> up. <gasps> Maybe separate the molds a little. Maybe. Just kind 
Just gonna go for it. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna let this set up and go to the next color and try to clean the mold up a little bit. Here are back. That's it for the pour. I need to go ahead and add my add my jellyfish on now, which is probably going to be another fast forward situation. So here we go. Oh, uh, you wanted me to put glitter. Light yes. dusting of silver hollow. Silver hollow. So at Kat's suggestion, I'm going to do a super light dusting of silver hollow. I, I don't think there's going to be a whole lot of the top that's going to be visible around the jellyfish, but just in case. Okay, there it is. I'm so nervous. <laughs> I'm so nervous. This is the last one. What if it's not good? What if I don't like it? Huh? Huh? <laughs> I think it'll be fine. I think it will be pretty. I hope so. Okay, um, let's get in close. For my jellyfish. So the nerves continue, but we are hopeful that maybe this will come out okay and I won't hate it. I don't know. We'll see. It sure smells good. I'll tell you that much. It definitely smells good. So <laughs> we're going to let this set up and we will give this a cut tomorrow. So we'll see you in a second. Bye. We have a nervous raven. <laughs> Hello. Welcome back. I'm anxious. Woo! Which is why we are filming while the kids are still away. Mm -hmm. Because I, I need to know. I need to know how this came out. Like, here. Here's the soap butt. Promising, right? And yet, I am sitting here deeply questioning whether or not this is going to evoke jellyfish properly enough. I don't know. I'm nervous. It smells really good, which is great. But what if it's ugly? What if it's terrible and I hate it? I'll cry. Let's just pull the trigger and let's just get it over with. Yes. Here we go. Ready? Focused? Yes. All right. Here we go. You know, surprisingly little cuts on the jellies. Very few. Considering how big they are. We appear to be focused. Uh, I mean, kind of. That's a, a little bit evocative. Maybe a little bit of jellyfish. I suppose. Kind of sorta. Kind of, sort of. Uh, I mean, maybe, right? Maybe a, a little bit of jelly. It's kind of not really jellyfish-like. <laughs> I mean, the top is. Yeah. I mean, I like it. It's. I don't know if it's... I don't know if I look at that and think jelly. You know? It's really pretty. <sighs> I'm a little, I'm a little bit bummed. <laughs> it's I, really pretty though. Yeah, no, I, I like it. I like it. Like, don't, don't get me wrong. I like it. Would I look at that without the top and go, that's supposed to look like a jellyfish? Probably not. But maybe. <sighs> right, hold on. Oh, my, my mom is calling. Hey, Mom. Okay. Love you, too. Bye. I love my mom. Get it together. Come on. There we go. So, yeah. I, I like it. Like, I like it. Jellyfish. Eh. But it's cute. I do really like the top. I think yes. the top is really pretty. Got some good spindlies on this one, I think. Yeah. I I feel like maybe if you know it's jellyfish, you see it, and you're like, yeah, okay, yeah, sure. I feel like if you didn't know it was jellyfish, you'd be like, it's pretty. <laughs> I'm 
that may be a big old dork about jellyfishes. So 100%, I, I feel like one of the next tattoos I want to get, I want to get like on my forearm, you know, like I have, I have this one. Like I'd like to get another that bids like jellyfish. I think that would be really cool. What about uh, gay water fit color jellyfish? I don't need everything to be rainbow. <laughs> <laughs> Look, but make I'm it gay. Queer. I'm proud of being queer, but I don't need every single thing in my life to be rainbow. <laughs> Look, I know your feelings on this, okay? Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows. Sure. <laughs> this one, this one, when I asked for those really long spoons that you use that are like the twirly spoons <laughs> to stir your coffee with, I was like, I just want a couple of those, just like some plain ones, like not a bit, just need a couple of those for my birthday. What does this one do? Rainbow. <laughs> so they match the rest of the silverware. They don't even live with the rest of the silverware. And you don't even use them. <laughs> and I just wanted plain ones. You like my the rainbow spoons I got you. They're pretty, but I don't need everything to be rainbow. Sometimes I just want things to be plain. Or like the rainbow knives. They needed to match the rainbow knives. Why don't you just let me be born? <laughs> Why am I not allowed to be boring? Good friends don't let their friends be boring. I can be boring if I want to be boring. <laughs> Get away from me with your glitter. <laughs> <laughs> um, and just because I know this is a really prominent <coughs> logo on my shirt here, not any kind of sponsorship or anything. It's just this is the brand that I bought my work laptop, like my business laptop through. And this was a free shirt that came with it when I ordered it. And it's actually soft and comfy. Not often that the swag stuff is actually nice. This is very comfortable. It makes me happy. And I'm having kind of a fibro flare up for the last couple of days. So being comfy and happy is more important than worrying about what shirt I'm wearing on camera. So <laughs> I hope you don't mind. You know that what that last song I sang? The sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows. That, mm -hmm. that's my killing spree song. I don't know what to do with this information. <laughs> Everybody has one. Do they? Do they? Do they really? Okay, sound off in the comments what your um what your murder spree song is. This is a weird <laughs> question to be encouraging people to write <laughs> comments for. I want to I, I want to know so I can oh, listen to these allegedly. songs. Allegedly. <laughs> allegedly. <laughs> this is for a joke. <laughs> Chad is being joking. Thank you. Please do not go on a killing spree. <laughs> just just type in what song you would be playing in the background should you do that theoretically. No. <laughs> I have concerns. Theoretically. No, no. one's actually going to do it. Uh. All right, let's get the final shot done. Because it's getting shenanigans. <laughs> As usual, here's your final close-up on my jellyfish design. This, along with the rest of the Undersea Collection, is going to be available tomorrow, Friday the 26th, at 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, just like usual. We really hope to see you there. We're going to have four total designs available for you, and it is, of course, time for your hydration reminder. Please make sure you go and water your body. You need some water. Tea? That counts. You can do that. Coffee? I guess. Uh, coffee counts. Coffee counts. As so long as it's, you know, actually got water in it. <laughs> so do that. I don't know, man. Make me. I'm, I, like I said, I'm in the middle of a fibro flare up and I'm not feeling 100%. So I'm doing my best. I hope you're doing your best, regardless of what that looks like. So we will see you for next time and for the launch tomorrow. Have a most excellent day. Bye, everybody. 